Hi, this video is from interview.com. Interview.com is a job portal. If you are looking for a job, you can log on to interview.com and you can post your resume with us. In this video, I am going to talk about very important basic Java entry question. Can program entry as you all know public static void main is a special method for the program entry you have a java application and you want to run and public static void main is the main entry for the program you can overload main method in any ways but if you change the signature of the main method the entry point for the program will be gone so please be careful whenever you overload overload the main method the best practice is don't overload the main method but you can overload the other methods so don't try to overload the main methods though it is legal so these are the two signatures allowed for uh, for the entry point methods that is, that is public static void main public static void main static public void main you can change the order so I am going to show you an example for overloading the main methods I have given three examples there are other ways you can overload the method but three examples so that you can understand so the first one is I am overloading static public static int main only a single param string argument whereas here string arguments string array arguments whereas here string arguments then second main method has two parameters two string string 1 and string 2 so you know the the overloading pattern will be like you can have multiple number of you should have multiple number of params by type you can differentiate okay same name but different params that's where the overload concept comes into picture and the last method is main method I'm overloading using string and int let's debug and check how exactly it works started the application so I'm going to call the first to overloaded main method okay can you see so it comes to the main method and it returns 0 okay so again it goes to second overloaded main method which is an instance method whereas this is this is the static method this is an instance method these two are instance methods so second overload method is called and the third main overload method we are calling with the two parameters are string and integer value so so this is how you can overload the main method the entry point method you can overload but best practices don't overload it Hope this video is useful for your Java interview preparation. Thank you and all the best for your interview. Thank you.